what's the biggest category of call that uh, the car gets called out to? The critical gear desk will send us to cardiac arrest the majority of the time. What special equipment do you use for the cardiac arrest typically? So we'll take uh, our primary bag, the defibrillator, the drugs and uh, the Lucas, which is a manual chest compression device, which I'll show you actually. So this, this device um, gives us the ability to provide good quality chest compressions continuously. It doesn't get tired and it gives us the ability to work around the patient, manage their airway and also um, reverse the causes that we feel that, that cause the cardiac arrest in the first place, or at least attempt to. So the backboard will go behind the patient, behind the shoulder blades, and this will just fit under the armpits, connect, connect on to the board, either side. Once we've done that, the device then can be placed onto the chest and then, as you can see, it's just doing chest compression. So that just gives us the ability to have hands free, work around the airway, get intravenous access, give drugs, and so on and so forth. And that's just an, an adjunct to, you know, all the other bits and computers that we carry. So the defibrillator is in there with monitoring if we get a ROSC. The primary bag that's got all our airway management in, oxygenation, ventilation, drug therapy, if we need to give any drugs to reverse, any causes of cardiac arrest to give adrenaline that uh, is still indicated, um, and our suction to uh, deal with any airway management issues that we have. So that's, that's basically uh, the, the stuff that we'll take to all cardiac arrests particularly for adults anyway.